Our River Valley is a bit brighter thanks to the team at Parkdale Cromdale Community League. We had people in the community come to us and say, well, you know, the, the retaining walls are getting vandalized and we'd like to kind of do something different. So we took that idea and thought, well, why don't we make a community project? So, President of the Board, Sebastian Barrera, set the idea into motion. I said, I will take that to the next level. We will make it happen. So as soon as the City of Edmonton now at the end of August told us that we was allowed to use it, I started with make the phone calls and calling people and set up meetings and we make it happen. Now in the Kennard Ravine, you can be captivated by 1,900 square feet of outdoor art. In total, there's 13 organizations, and this probably involved more than 120 people. At Boiler Street Community Service, we work with homeless youth, developing 15 murals that you can see displays in this project. One young man excited to show off his collaboration is Eric Smallboy with iHuman. And there's like half and half, there's like the city from nature, and then in between the piece and the piece stuff. This art installation hopes to curb the graffiti and inspire those utilizing our trail system. Well, I think it's going to be super shocking for people when they come down here and they've been, you know, it's a dull day, they're riding their bike or with their family, they're skiing down here in the winter, whatever the case might be, and then they're just like, what is this? This hidden gem uh, in the right in the, in the heart of the city. Revolution! For go. I'm Jordan Hurtner. I can't believe you say it. <laughs>